Ladies and gentlemen, dear members, partners, faculty, and all of our new champions, thank you for your active and engaged participation in this, our ninth annual meeting of new champions. Thanks to your interactions, we have learned a great deal. All of the scientists that I met were impressed by the rich insights they gained from meeting leaders from different disciplines and fields with whom they no normally interact. Thanks to our innovators, tech pioneers, and entrepreneurs, we now understand the brilliant work going on at the frontiers of business, science, and technology, which is bringing science fiction closer to science reality on a daily basis. But this conversation wasn't limited to Dalian. It was a global conversation with over 12 televised debates, 25,000 news stories, and half a million people discussing on the Forum Agenda platform. All of these elements confirm that the annual meeting of new champions has truly become the world's leading meeting on science, technology, innovation, entrepreneurship, and sustainability. This global meeting, hosted in China, would not be possible without the excellent collaboration we enjoy with the Chinese government and our host city. On behalf of the World Economic Forum, I want to thank the city of Dalian, and it is now my pleasure to ask Mr. Lu Lin, Vice Mayor of the Dalian government, to give his remarks. Distinguished uh, Schwab and distinguished David Ekman, distinguished uh, Duan Chunhua, Vice Executive Mayor of Tianjin, distinguished guests, ladies and gentlemen, good afternoon. The three day summer Davos in Dalian is being successfully concluded with the great support of all as well as the joint efforts of all. This is a great event, reflecting the great leadership as well as friendship. And uh, the 1,700 participants from all over the world are gathering here and have free discussions. And uh, this presents a great exchange of ideas and insightful ideas. And we are here to have a free, open, forward-looking, insightful conversation on the topic of charting a new course for growth. It is an uh, exchange of ideas, even a collision, argument, and convergence. At this event, our Premier Li Keqiang made excellent uh, keynote speech and expressed uh, the ideas opinions on the current economic development and the questions from the audience. And this opening remarks elevated this forum. And the successful organization of this summer Davos event provided a golden opportunity for Dalian to learn from the world-class philosophy and ideas. This event also provides opportunity that Dalian is, is greatly disclosed to the international community. And ex the exchange and cooperation will further improve the development. And we would like to work with the international community to present with a more open gesture, great uh, dynamics to contribute to the global economic development and common prosperity with the new positioning. Successful event has also credit to the trust of the Chairman Schwab, the joint support of the Chinese ministries and sister cities, as well as the hard working of all volunteers and the staff. I would like to thank all of you. Now we have drawn the beautiful new course for the new development. And uh, we hope next next year we'll have a greater event, greater exchange of ideas, uh, and uh, 
great uh, new course for growth to be depicted in Tianjin next year. So now we wish the next event in Tianjin a greater success, and we believe that uh, the summer doubles in Tianjin next year will be a better event than this one in Dalian. We are looking forward to seeing all of you in Tianjin. Thank you. Thank you, Vice Mayor Liu. As you know, next year will mark the 10th anniversary of our annual meeting of new champions. And so it's now my great pleasure to invite our host for next year, Mr. Duan Chuaha, Executive Vice Mayor of Tianjin, to give his remarks. Respected uh, Mr. David Ekman, respected uh, Mr. Vice Mayor Lulin, ladies and gentlemen, 2015 Summer Davos come to an end. On behalf of Tianjin Municipal Government, I would like to extend my warmest congratulations to the success of WF annual meeting and, uh, and the leadership of Mr. Schwab. The globally re renowned Summer Davos has greater and greater influence and uh, play a bigger and bigger role with the uh, much higher level as the um, great exchange of ideas. Every year, the annual meeting attracted global attention and also laid the uh, trends of global economic development. The theme of this forum is exactly reflects the uh, common expectation of the international arena and will play a very important role for the economic development at the global level. With this opportunity, I would like to extend my respect to Mr. Schwab, Chairman of WEF, as well as WEF. Three days are short, but within these short three days, we feel the hospitality and enthusiasm of Dalian people. We also learn the successful experiences of this annual meeting. We also like to thank the hospitality and the thoughtful arrangement from Dalian City. Just now, uh, Mr. Lulian mentioned that uh, next year's 2016 Summer Davos will be held in Tianjin. We believe that um, and the excellent leadership of Mr. Schwab and with the great support from NDRC and other relative ministries, in particular with your great support and also with the successful experiences from Dalian City, Tianjin will again give us a great meeting and forum next year. Here, I would like to, on behalf of Tianjin, to invite all of you to come to Tianjin in Tian 2016, and uh, Tianjin is looking forward to your coming. Welcome to Tianjin. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you, Executive Vice Mayor Duan. Ladies and gentlemen, I will now bring this session to an end. But before I do, in addition to our faculty and participants, I would like to say a few more thank yous to our volunteers, hostesses, and security personnel for their hard work in keeping us safe and happy. To my fellow World Economic Forum colleagues, thank you for your incredibly hard work in making this meeting so effective and so impactful in such a smooth and efficient way. Thank you also to my predecessor, Olivier Schwab, and to the entire China office staff for such a warm and easy transition for me into China. The ninth annual meeting of new champions is now officially closed, and I invite you all to join us downstairs for a farewell reception. Thank you.